Hi everyone, my name's Chuck. I have a 49 Chevy 3100. I utilize YouTube a lot to try to help figure out little things that you can't normally find out uh, regarding these type of engines and trucks. And one thing I found um, that we didn't have a whole bunch of was the heat spring. Um, and I just got done rebuilding my manifold and I've got this heat spring down here. Uh, where is it? There it is. So right there. So I got the heat spring. Okay. Now, as you guys already know, there's a valve in there that there's a flapper that when the engine heats up, it uh, shuts it off and um, makes it where uh, you can have normal operating temperatures. Basically, it's meant for a cold start. So I had the hardest time trying to figure out how to get that on. So I'll give you a, a close up shot. I had to bend it. It did not come set correctly. See if we can get the zoom. So I had to bend it, as you could see. So it, this way it grabs when it opens and it grabs when it closes. So let me demonstrate with a heat gun to show you what it looks like when it closes, okay? See it's turning. As you can see, it turned the the valve because that simulates the heat, the engine heating up. Then I got this can of uh, Ultra Duster. It's just basically uh, uh, just compressed air. So I'm going to spray this on that, and then you can see it release. So it took me a little while to figure that out, but hopefully that helps someone out there. If you have any questions, just feel free to give me a call uh, or uh, give me a message. Um, also, just to let you guys know, this little flap right here, when it's retracted like this, that's in the open position. And when it's forward, that's in the closed position. Just to let you know. All right. Good luck.